How remarkable. That view down below is the world where we live, isn't it? So it would appear. I had no idea it was possible for humans to reach these kind of heights. And this world tree has been around since forever, too. I'm not sure I can keep up with what they're finding out here. Hey, Prince, look! Over down there! What is it? You see something? Look! Right over there! It's Genbu! That's gotta be Genbu! Seriously? Wow, you're right! That does look like Tantal. What are you talking about? Of course we can't see Tantal from all the way up here. We totally can, though! Come over and take a look! Frankly, I'm not interested. Oh, come on! You're no fun! We've come all the way to a crazy place like this. The least you can do is enjoy yourself a bit. I'm in the wrong here. Might I remind you we did not come here to have fun. Everyone needs to let their hair down once in a while, Bridget. Lady Morag. Myself, I have already spotted the Leftherian Archipelago. <laughs> what? Those tiny little islands? Well, what do you know? Morag's really getting into this. Come on, Prince. We can't let her beat us. No chance of that. Take a look over there. Huh? I can't see anything. Look real close. There's a tiny dot right there. See? I'm pretty sure that's Goldmuth, the Argentum HQ. Goldmuth? Are you certain? Where is this dot? I'm not seeing anything. Yes, that must be Goldmuth. I'm sure of it. You can see it, Lady Morag? Bridget, we must find something new ourselves, else I fear we have lost. When did this become a competition? If that is Goldmuth, would that be the maelstrom next to it? Um, well, I suppose it could be. Oh, look down there, Bridget. The Nopon sailors on board the maelstrom are waving to us. What? Uh, Morag, I think you might be pushing it a bit with that one. I tell you no lie, I saw it with my own eyes. Seriously? Uh, Lady Morag. I think you may just be seeing Tora's reflection in the window. No, you're wrong. I'm certain it was the crew of the Maelstrom. Hmm. Well, that was a bunch of fun. Yeah, if I learned one thing today, it's that Morag hates to lose. <laughs>